Hello, my name is Bernice Davidson and I'm an instructor here at Martin Methodist College and also um, in the head of the art club here. And we have a wonderful project that um, I want to um, roll out to you today that the art club has been involved in in honor of Black History Month. And we are discussing the ideas of using art to help educate our community in terms of who our hometown heroes are. And so we have discovered a hero that I am so excited about to share with you today. And this is Giles County's very own Matt Gardner. Now, some of you may have heard of Matt Gardner and some of you may not, but I'll tell you that Matt Gardner was a freed slave who lived in Elkton uh, back in the 1800s and the early 1900s. He lived a long time. He lived into his 90s. And uh, he was the most marvelous man. He, he and his wife, Rita, raised 11 children. They s founded three schools, three separate schools, to educate the black children in the area during their time. He was a pastor for three churches. He um, helped save many farms by lending money when farmers were in trouble. Um, he had a store where he sold the surplus of his farm goods to the community to help them out. He won a, uh, an award from the governor uh, by uh, growing 75% of all the food for his 11 children and all of his uh, farm animals and also having surplus to sell. And he um, bought 15 acres in the middle of the Elk River, which he and his church members used to baptize people. And um, the most beautiful thing is that he shared this area in the Elk River, which was a sandbar, with all of the black and white churches of his time uh, so that they could all take turns using it to baptize. So with all these ideas and this marvelous, marvelous person uh, in our midst, we've been generating some artwork uh, that we wanted to share with you today. The first thing I'd like to show you is the painting of the baptism in the Elk River. And Matt Gardner's um, family has created a museum called the Matt Gardner Homestead Museum, which is right in downtown uh, Elkton, near the bridge there, uh, which uh, has um, a lot of the relics from his life. And this is going to be an oil painting that will be in the Matt Gardner Homestead Museum, and it shows a typical baptism. And um, the thing that I found out about um, how the baptisms worked was on the bridge, everyone in the community would gather and share the beauty and the spirit of the baptism scene. And so you can see the whole community gathered there. And as I said, that all races uh, were welcome to use this river as the baptism place, and I kind of feel that it's the river of spirit. And you can see um, the Matt Gardner homestead up on the hill behind the bridge there, and the family lived very, very close to the Elk River.